In this exercise, we will learn foreground and background color options and the screen mode options. Let's see how these tools will work. The foreground and background color options are used to change the colors. Here, we can see the foreground color and behind it. It is the background color. By default, we see black and white colors. But here, we can see a little arrow on it. That is used to switch the colors. If I press the D key, D stands for default, then it will change the color into the default black and white colors. When I press the X key, then we can see here the colors are switching. And we can double click on it to change it. And we can select any color from here. Now, let's see the screen modes options. We can see there are window icons here. Right click on this, and we can see the standard screen mode, full screen mode with menu bar, and full screen mode. The default is the standard screen mode, and we can change this one by one, something like this. Or we can use its F shortcut key. Then we can view the screen mode by pressing many times until we find the view we want. Okay, in the next exercise, we will learn the quick mask tool.